HC Today, Tuesday edition. Today I'd like to bring you a short devotional um, from a book from Max Lucado. We'll give him the credit for the writing and the research, but it's a great message I'd like to share with you today. It comes from the book of Romans. When the church in Rome was debating whether to eat meat offered to idols, did Paul tell them to start two churches, one for the meat eaters and one for those that don't eat meat? No, on the contrary, he urged, Christ accepted you, so you should accept each other, which will bring glory to God, Romans 15, 7. Is God asking us to do anything more than what he has already done? Hasn't he gone a long way in accepting us? If God can tolerate my mistakes, can't I tolerate the mistakes of others? If a God allows me with my foibles and failures to call him Father, shouldn't I extend the same grace to others? In fact, who can offer grace except those secure in the grip of grace? If God doesn't demand perfection, should I? God's ship is a grand vessel. Just as a ship has many rooms, so God's kingdom has room for many opinions. But just as a ship has one deck, God's kingdom has a common ground, the all-sufficient sacrifice of Jesus Christ. Will you pray for me, pray with me today? Our Heavenly Father, we're so thankful that our God has built us a ship. He's built us a ship with many rooms, and many opinions may lie within this ship. But that ship is built on one solid deck, the solid deck of Jesus Christ, our Savior. And it's in him who we gain strength and we gain our salvation. Lord, be with us in all that we do and help us to understand that even though our opinions may differ, we still serve the same God. Bless us in all that we do. Bring us together. In Christ's unity. Amen. Have a great day.